Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets Restream tutorial video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to set up an RTMP poll from Restream in OBS Studio. So in this video, we'll start with going over what exactly an RTMP poll is, the different use cases for it and ways to use it, and then I'll show you how to set it up so that you can actually use the RTMP poll in OBS Studio. Now before we get started, I do want to disclose this video is sponsored by Restream, so thank you to Restream for sponsoring this video and making it possible. So let's start off by answering the question, what is an RTMP poll? An RTMP poll is a really cool feature within Restream that allows anyone with a professional membership in Restream to basically export their live stream so that other people can use it in their own live streams. So as you can see here, I am currently live streaming on Restream and I've set up an RTMP poll in my account and then taken that RTMP poll and added it to OBS here, as you can see. Now this can be useful if you're going to be collaborating with someone, you want them to be able to use your Restream for something, maybe you're doing a live event, or you wanna allow them to provide some commentary over your stream. I've also seen this where churches or large companies allow live translations. So they use an RTM people from their account, and then they have someone doing live translations over their actual live stream. But basically what it allows someone else to do is use your live stream in their own content. Now, like I said before, an RTM people feature on your account does require a professional subscription, so you will have to have a paid membership with Restream. Now, check the link in the description because if you do upgrade your account to professional and you use my link, you'll get $10 off your first month. All right, so let's go ahead and get started with how to actually set this up within your Restream account and then get your RTMP poll to work in OBS Studio. All right, so the first thing we need to do to get started in Restream is simply go to our dashboard and we can get there by logging into our Restream account and then just going over to the left sidebar and selecting Dashboard. Once you get here, over in the right side under Ready to Go Live, you'll see RTMP pull links. Just go over to the right and select the little plus symbol to drop down the options. As you can see, I already have one created, but to create your own link, all you need to do is go to Create Link, then you can add a name for it, just something that allows you to identify it. I'll just do Gaging Gadgets tutorial, then select save. Now we have the RTMP poll link created. Now to actually share the RTMP poll link with someone so they can use it in their own content, all we need to do is select the drop down here. And if they're using OBS Studio, they need to select merge fields. This will give you one link that you can then copy and share with them. So go ahead and copy this and then share that with the person that is going to be adding it to their content. Now in this tutorial, we'll just be copying that URL and then opening OBS Studio, where I'm going to create a brand new scene so that I could add that RTMP poll to OBS Studio. So I'm gonna create a new scene here, name it RTMP poll tutorial, and then select OK. Now all we need to do to add the RTMP poll to OBS under Sources is add a new source, select the plus symbol, and then go to Media Source. Go ahead and create a new one. Now just unselect Local File, in input, paste the RTMP poll link that we copied from Restream. And then under input format, just type FLV. That's all we need to do. You can select OK now. And now when I go live on Restream, it'll show up in my actual Restream account. And in OBS, the first time you actually use the RTMP poll link, you will need to open up the source and allow it to buffer. It'll start pulling that in and then it will start receiving the actual RTMP pull from Restream. You can select OK, and then you have successfully added your RTMP pull to OBS Studio. From there, if you want to, you can add things such as a webcam, you can add overlays, anything you want to, to customize your stream, but you now have the RTMP pull from Restream added to your OBS Studio. All right, so that's how you set up an RTMP poll from Restream in OBS Studio. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Restream tutorial videos, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up, and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.